Hello everyone and welcome back. So we will be continuing with our previous uh, lesson. And in the previous lesson we have got and uh, created a table and then fields and also field, field types. And we have also seen a enum. So today I will go and uh, say more about the enum and how to create your own enum. Uh, like checkbox and also a uh, uh, combo box and radio box so we have created one field called status okay so let's create uh, another field uh, enum So we have created a new field and let's give as uh, start name as active and copy this one and paste here the tree. Okay, so now enum type what we'll do is give no yes. Okay. And we'll also create a new enum. Okay. And new base enum. Okay. So give a name. product status and give the name same we will fill out the same of three fields over here mm. okay. save it and we will add a new element so you can add up to 256 elements and element starts from 1 so from 1 to 256 you can add an element so let's create a new element and for the new element what we keep it as a empty element and create uh, another one and another one we give a name as um, on stock okay and let's create a value as on stock and also I'll add a new element and we create a no stock copy this and paste this over here on stock and no stock okay so we have created two and save it okay what we'll do now here is create a new group and we'll call it as uh, base enum okay base enum okay so move it down out and down arrow so after that we'll move our base enum over here okay okay so our field is over here so we will just drag it drop it over here 
So enum type is product status. Um, product status. So we will remove this one status. So we will save it and restore it and also synchronize back to the database. So we have created our own enum okay, which has three elements and now our field is uh, let's go and open our table. So now you can see here uh, our new is active uh, active field over here which we have is in a mess no yes no yes is simply will put a checkbox active 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 and we have also added uh, another enum and let's just create so you can see on stock and no stock so first element you can see as element one so what we will go over here is we will product status and oops, I gave our wrong name over here so it should be PRO DUCT product status and let's just rename it because we made some spelling mistake over here and I'm so sorry for that okay now save it and we'll restore back and our name is we will remove this one utility and we will add back our product status column over here save it and restore and start to match okay so let's just open it okay now you can see here active and our product status what we want to do now over here is we want to remove this element and make it as a blank so we can select that blank field so in the uh, element one what we give us name as a blank and this one give us a blank okay save it and save it restore it and synchronize back to the database and open the table okay so thank you nice back okay okay now you can see we have a one blank so now you can select an empty combo box so this is a combo box and this is a checkbox and radio box uh, radio button we will see on uh, when we do a form so on the table level we are doing a checkbox and a combo box so this is how we create a enum and we have created our own enum 
and we have also used a uh, system default enum widget and yes no so you can create your own enum and add into your uh, tables field so this way you can uh, add up to uh, 256 elements on a enum okay so i think i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks thanks for watching